Hey, everybody, Thomas here. Today I've got a few things to talk about. One of the things is we're going to be doing a sawmill show down here in Mississippi. That's probably the most important thing. We're doing a sawmill show down here in Mississippi the 30th of April or the 7th of May as a backup. It was a great experience last time we did at Mr. Roberts' house. It was a great experience. This time we're looking to have a couple sawmills here. If you're a local sawmill in the area, so we're down here in Loosedale, Mississippi, if you're local in the area and would like to bring your sawmill here, please contact me. I think we're going to look to probably have three sawmills here. I'll have mine here. We'll have another one, uh, maybe Neil's or something like that, or Joby's. And then uh, we'll see if we can bring kind of like a, a mixture of sawmills. I think that's a, a great way to not only see other sawmills, but to see other sawyers in the area. So if you're local, then you know kind of who to contact for your wood needs or how to network with people and to go over you know how to do things all right so the other thing is parking out here i'll be doing so this entire side over there will be cleaned up i probably have enough parking for about 60 to 70 vehicles i'm also going to have everything off that fence line there i'll have it all marked out so people know where to park should be a very good environment uh, safe for the kids and everything we have a whole lot of things out here we've got the goats i'll probably have the dogs put up because they're little turds and they just like to get underneath everyone's feet um, but we also have the pond down here, so we might have some adults that would like to chaperone down there if, if kids want to go fishing or something like that. So anyway, beautiful pond down there to fishing. So the other thing I'm going to talk about is while we do the sawmill show, I'll have some pretty good logs. These logs are all set up because these are going to be videos here in the future. Next week or two, I'll get all these videos done. But <clears throat> I'll have uh, a good mixture of logs. We'll have some cherry. We'll have some ash. We'll have some black walnut, red elm. We'll, we'll cut some unique things that people really enjoy, something you don't get to typically see, and there will be a lot of giveaways. So I'm asking people, if you're going to come to the show, make sure you subscribe to the channel because there will be a big giveaway to subscribers of the channel, and then there will be another giveaway that we'll do for everyone, including subscribers of the channel and non-subscribers. But it would behoove you to subscribe to the channel because we're going to be giving away a very unique very beautiful bench and I will show a video of that in the upcoming weeks making of the bench and that it will be a giveaway during the actual event other giveaways will probably be charcuterie boards and then slabs that we cut up on the mill we'll have to have some stuff out here with Mr. Robert random tools Mr. Robert and all that good stuff the other thing I'm going to talk about is our place will be up for sale here soon so we have a beautiful place out here I absolutely love this farm and it's really sad that we have to leave this location the house is a four bedroom, 2,310 square foot. I converted the back porch into a sunroom that overlooks our Mississippi Mountain View out there. And if you come out here and see that, and if, if you drive down 613 in the Loosedale area, you've seen this view because I have people stop by all the time saying like, are you going to sell? Like your view is amazing. Yeah, it is. It is amazing. I've also made probably the most amazing wood shop for whoever gets this place. And it's I love it, and I'm really sad because I put a lot of blood, sweat, and tears into this building here. This was going to be my storefront, um, or it could be a man cave, she shed, Airbnb, mother-in-law suite, whatever. Fully insulated. We're working on the electrical. The electrical should be done next week where they're going to tie it in from the pole to the building, have its own meter and all that good stuff. It's got, uh, what, 10-foot uh, wide wings on either side with a 12-foot roof overhead. And on the inside, it's 24 by 24, and I've got a lot of wood in here and stuff like that. It's got a very rustic oak floor, and it has no same species of wood touches itself in the walls. It is absolutely insane, all the amazing stuff. The only place it does touch itself is on this wall right here where we have the deer head because that was the first wall I started putting up before I changed my plans. And still, it looks amazing because it's pine of different colors and stuff like that. The only thing I probably won't get to before I move is the bathroom. That In there, I have a, a sectioned off area where it's supposed to be a shower, a commode, and a sink, and a no left turn. But uh, yeah, that I'm just running out of time. And this, this bench over here could be a bench or it could also be where you could have like a counter and sink and all that stuff. But again, a lot of these slabs here, so this is a, a mixture of things here, but a lot of the stuff in the background there is all black walnut. We have a lot of black walnut we have to move. We got a lot of mantles I still have to move. Oh, and there is a loft up above too. 
my kids, when they uh, want to do sleepovers and stuff like that, they can come out here. It's a 12 by 12 loft. And I put the railing up so no one kills themselves. And it does have an AC unit out here. As soon as I get the power hooked up to it, it'll be good. As you see, we've got like cypress slabs. You got ash, um, red elm, maple, all sorts of stuff. Future project working on a, a maple slab there. There's a table underneath. An amazing door. Heavy, amazing door. And uh, yeah, just all wood everywhere. So yeah, again, I, I hope to see you all out here for the Salmo show. And like I said, we are looking to sell this house. We're going to list it in April. Or I might even put a for sale sign out there right now. Haven't decided yet. But um, anyways, beautiful place. Five acres, pond. Uh, beautiful views, 90 feet above any closest body of water, so no flooding to worry about. Absolutely love this place, going to miss it. The carport that I built here, all built by me, but it's a 24 by 36 foot building. Then we have a 10 foot wing off this side. We store, got the dog cage in there and everything, but we store the side-by-side -side four wheelers and stuff like that. Inside there is a heated and cooled 12 by 24 space concrete slab and everything and then there's also a back porch that's a 12 by 24 back porch um concreted where you can have like your uh, grill and stuff like that but the room here that we use that's my wife's shop but also we keep our fridges and freezers and stuff like that where we process milk and and uh store our meats and stuff like that all there's wood all throughout the house as you saw some of the other episodes with the chinese fur wood walls and stuff like that our mantle there's a lot of cool things so anyways the Salma Show. Hoping to see y'all out there. We're going to have Mr. Robert here. We're going to have uh, probably Neil. We'll probably get some other Salmas out here. I'll figure we'll set up one Salma on that side. We'll set up one Salma on this side. Looking to have three. Possibly a fourth Salma. If it's a small one, maybe we might be able to fit it in here next to the building. And uh, the dates are, again, 30 April with a backup of um, 7 May. So, again, please like, subscribe. And I, I do encourage you to subscribe because... The giveaway we're going to do is going to be a beautiful bench. And we also have some other things throughout the day. Ram Tools, Mr. Robert. Those are always fun. Yeah, fun event. We'll probably have a good fire going or something like that if it's not too windy or nasty or something like that. But it's going to be fun. Hope you enjoy this uh, video. Hope you enjoy the channel. And I uh, look forward to meeting people. So again, please like, subscribe. We'll see you around. Thanks.